Hi students, this is Synergy's recruitment drive to take youngsters to join as engine cadet or trainee marine engineers. And who can join, who will be eligible is the students who are finishing their marine engineering or already completed marine engineering or who are pursuing their marine engineering in last year and other category, they are not very specific about it, but other category can be eligible who have completed GME or who are pursuing their GME and does not have any placement. So for such candidates, the selection process is on the forms you have to fill up on this uh, link which is provided here which will cost about 1000 or 1500 fees you will have to pay online for the filling up of the form booking yourself and uh, last date of filling up form is 1st May and exam date is 15 to 19th May so exam is still about two months away the last date of filling up form is one month away one and a half month away and uh, this is good opportunity for the uh, marine engineers who have already passed out or passing out without placement and GME. So let us see further details. This we have already discussed about uh, the link which is here and the filling up form last date is 1st of May and exam dates are 15 to 19th May. Okay, now here they are providing eligibility criteria. See, they are not saying that GME is eligible, but by looking at this eligibility, I can make out the GME candidates who do not have placement, they also can be eligible. Okay, should have born after 1st January 1997. So this is easy, you can understand very easily. Should have scored 60% PCM, in 12th so this is also very easy so at that time when you have cleared your 12th you should have had 60 percent in pcm as well as 60 percent overall aggregate in 12th okay in case of diploma in marine engineering you should have aggregate of 60 percent if you have done diploma of marine engineering and then degree then you should have had 60 percent while passing your diploma should have obtained 50% marks in English in 10th or 12th. So this is also quite easy. 50% marks you should have got in English subject when you have done your 10th or 12th. Should have completed pre-C training. Now pre-C training, there are two types of training pre-C training here. One is marine engineering. Other one is graduate marine engineering. So any one of them you should have completed and if you are even becoming eligible if you are in third year or appearing for final semester so if you are in ty or third year of your engineering or in final semester also you can become eligible and give this exam but in final year 50 percent aggregate in third and final year is also compulsory so there are a lot of conditions but this gme is not very clear so the students may not uh, uh, be able to uh, visualize that so you can GME boys also can be eligible here now how the exam is going to be there is going to be three hours exam having 200 marks 200 are multi choice question having one mark each question first hundred marks are based on your engineering knowledge and this engineering knowledge is going to be marine engineering. This is not your mechanical engineering or whichever any other. This is marine engineering because the boys eligible for this test are marine engineers or graduate marine engineers. So marine engineering 100 marks and remaining 100 marks are for English and aptitude. So likewise this exam will take place. There will be negative marking. So how much negative marking for each wrong answer you give, there will be negative marking of 0.25.
minus marks will be 0.25 for every wrong answer. So four wrong answers you give, you will be having one mark negative, one mark minus from your total. And if you have not attempted the question at all, आपने छोड़ दिया क्वेश्चन तो उसके लिए कोई भी नेगेटिव मार्किंग नहीं है ना तो पॉजिटिव मार्किंग भी है कोई भी इफेक्ट उसमें नहीं होने वाला है लेकिन या एज दिस एग्जाम इज ऑल इंडिया लेवल ऑल इंडिया बेसिस मेनी कैंडिडेट्स विल बी अपेयरिंग एंड द हाईएस्ट रैंकर्स हाईएस्ट मार्क अचीवर्स और हाइएस्ट मार्क्स हु गेट्स दे विल बी कॉल्ड फॉर इंटरव्यू सो definitely more than 70% if you are scoring then you can expect that you are going to be called for interview and after interview there there will be selection and then you will join ships as tme on this synergy group managed ships so this is uh, about your uh, explanation about your this exam and selection there is another video which i had uh, published last year Guidance for Synergy Selection Entrance Test 2022. Although this was not specific to marine engineering, but some part will be useful to you. So please uh, see this video also on YouTube. This is the link for that. And another video can be useful to you is this one: Techniques to Solve MCQs. So this is also my video which was uploaded last year. So both videos can be useful to you to get your more Uh, uh knowledge and to prepare in a better way for this competitive exam of synergy group so students this is a good opportunity students who are doing their marine engineering who are doing their graduate marine engineering gme or who have already passed out and are not having any placement so for them this is a very good opportunity please prepare and appear for the entrance exam of synergy group give interview and then get selected and get placed on board as tme trainee marine engineers so thank you so much for watching this video and bye